first footage of Dr. Disrespect's video game has surfaced online. And Dead Drop has received some pretty mixed reactions. This looks incredible, man. The game looks like Call of Duty Mobile. Puts this game in the dirt. The footage is underwhelming. Doc co-founded a brand new game studio called Midnight Society last year. And they finally unveiled what they have been working on. Dead Drop is described as a vertical extraction game. It's similar to games like Fortnite and Warzone where the playing zone gets smaller over time. But in Dead Drop, you're fighting upwards through a burning skyscraper. Dr. Disrespect made a pretty wild claim that he could take a screenshot of his game back in June and it would blow anything that the COD engine had out of the water. Water. I could take a screenshot of our of game right now in in game, and I, I don't think anything could match it. Well, now we've seen Dead Drop in action, and not everybody's convinced. It will be blowing Call of Duty out of the water, and yeah, boys, this is what we got. So, what have we actually seen so far? And when will the game be available for everyone? There are three clips: two of them showing off the shooting elements, and one showing off the world design. We haven't seen any of the PvP parts of the game yet. Instead, right now, it just looks like there's a bunch of shooting galleries and one single gun. Mannequins with metal skulls pop up, and the faster you shoot them, the more points you get. They were dialed in. But these are probably just practice areas found in your hideout, where you will also be able to trade loot. The final game will be very different. As well as having the spreading fire mechanic, Dead Drop will also have elements of escape from Tarkov, where you decide which loadout you bring in with you. Then when you're in the game, you'll be aiming to loot and extract with even better equipment. The problem is everything right now just looks super basic. Some people have already started to complain about the floaty shooting and the pretty bad frame rate. You build a game up, make it sound like it's gonna be the best thing since sliced bread and it ends up just being bread not impressed sure as hell isn't better than call of duty but these are all things that can be fixed further into development so doc fans shouldn't worry about what we've seen so far we are still a long way from dead drop even being done so why are they showing it off right now well midnight society dropped 10,000 founder pass nfts back in march giving owners early access to the game as well as a unique avatar july 30th was the first time they got their hands on the game and they'll be getting new builds of dead drop every six weeks so people started showing it off to the public whether it's ready to be shown to the public or not is a whole nother conversation shut the f up man right now dead drop is only available on pc to the nft owners and controller support will be added in the next update but they have plans to release a game on both playstation and xbox in the future as for the story dead drop focuses around a huge skyscraper look at how big that structure is known as refiner state we're 40 years into the so-called climate wars and these structures extracts toxins from the atmosphere to create space dust it's a highly lucrative substance so competing factions fight for control and they also go up against the cleaners who operate the towers there's a lot of work still to be done and with no release date even announced yet it looks like midnight society will be taking their time